So how did you make that transition then from agency work to management? Yeah. What, what was that like? So here I am. I, I, I had the two best desk at William Morris. And I'd put my, I would call it my Jewish entertainment guy uniform together, my, my, <laughs> my suits and my ties, and I'd walk down the halls, and something was missing still, you know, and I would just look at people, the agents there, and I did not see happiness. And I felt in the halls walking down there the stress level, and I would ask people, how was your weekend? And they would talk about just their client or a script. Nobody had hobbies. And... I said to myself, you know what? I'm gonna learn everything I can learn from this opportunity right now, but this is not gonna be my destiny. I said, hmm. I, and I had met at that time, now there's hundreds of management companies. At that time, maybe there were 20 reputable companies. It was not that common. And I said, management is what I wanna do because I think the difference uh, when you drive home from an agency, you say, hey man, I did what's best for the agency. When you drive home from being a manager, I drive home and, and all my employees and partners, we all drive home and we say, hey, I did what's best for our clients. And that, that little difference, okay, means the world to me. And the fact that I could, you know, be a great dad to both my kids, Coach both their little league uh, teams when they were kids, little kids, still play music, have a personal life, and also manage some of the best clients and, and be and involved in a lot of production. That, to me, that lifestyle about management where you, you have to spread yourself thin with your clients, but not as thin as agents, agencies with thousands of clients. Right. Big difference. So what is the sort of, I mean, there's some people here who may want to be agents or may want to be managers. How do you know the, maybe the personality type that should gravitate towards one or the other? We actually do almost the same thing. I mean, there's certain managers that are hand holders and, you know, we'll talk about your hair for 20 hours a week. And <laughs> I'm not that guy. And I tell people when I sign them, I'm not that guy. I'm all business. I'm proactive. I'm about getting jobs. I'm about you know, intro making introductions. The agents, the agencies, I, you know, some of my best friends are agents and they love it because they love how quick the momentum is. They love the fact that they have a breakfast, lunch, dinner, meeting, boom, boom, you know. They like that pace of it. And they also like the fact that, you know, they don't have to just be with when one client all the time. You know, they can move on to the other client and, you know, you know, so, they enjoy that, and um, you know, I, I think I could have enjoyed that for a couple of years too. Yeah. But but for me, the management pace and the way it's just spaced out through the day. I mean, look, we we're making just as many phone calls, but we're doing it for a smaller group of people. Mm -hmm.